has had a kind of teeter-totter career since then, but he is enormously popular here. The short program, Felipe Candeloro. He's so predictably unpredictable. Not only in the choice of music and choreography, but you never know what he's going to be able to pull off. Triple axel. Huge double toe loop. He skidded on a toe. He lost too much momentum. Going into the second jump, he can only do a double that will affect the first mark. Sometimes when the first jump is too big, the second one has to be smaller. step a little shallow on this side of the board some of the judges might deduct a little bit for that they want it to be a bigger circle <laughs> he does use everything doesn't he he does and the world stopped by the commentary booth during practice he said this is good i skate after Kalik. he will warm up the crowd his popularity here really began when he won the silver medal at the World Championships in Chiba near Tokyo after the Olympics in 1994. Trying to climb back on top of the podium. He stood third at the Olympics with Hermanov and Stoiko in 1994. Combination, the beginning of the program, you need to do triple-triple because this triple axle was so big. Look at the height on here. You'll see the landing right there. He loses all of his speed and can only get a double toe loop off instead of a triple. That will affect the difficulty level of the mark right there. Double axle at the end, an easy jump for everybody here. But he has a tendency to miss it sometimes. You lose some concentration or you just don't care about it that much. Coach is watching, saying, please don't miss the double axel. Just the double axel. Just don't miss the double axel. All right, fine, great. Try didn't shake his fist for the triple axel combination, but for the double, <laughs> that's where things can happen. Ever the showman. <laughs> Andre Brunet is the coach. And the marks for required elements for Candeloro. And you can really see where that triple-triple combination is necessary. The spins are okay. You know, all these things play into the mark. The footwork sequences are shallow. There's probably deductions there. And not difficult. But it's an entertaining program. 
Presentation. Presentation marks. Again, you can see the difference between the first and second mark. There were deductions, and I'm sure it came on the footwork. Well, that puts Candelora behind Ilya Kulik, who 